Hi guys, I hope you're all doing well. Welcome back to another video. Today we're gonna to be talking about ASOS and Pretty Lavish. So as you can see behind me, I've got quite a selection on the rail of spring pieces that I'm literally obsessed with. I know that's kind of a statement that gets said a lot in the internet world, but I already cannot wait to wear most of this and some of it I've actually already been wearing. So I'm gonna jump straight in and share with you the pieces. There's five from ASOS and four from Pretty Lavish. And we're gonna start with the one accessory hung on the end here, which is this little baguette bag from ASOS, which is a really nice soft faux leather cream bag with the kind of slightly darker cream, almost like snake effect on the side. Like it's like a faux croc. Same with the handle, which by the way, is completely detachable. So should you want to change this to something else, you totally could. Like if you wanted to add like a designer strap or a longer strap or a shorter strap or whatever the case may be, you can do that. But I love this. It's like the perfect size for every day and obviously being a youtuber i have to fit cameras in my bag every day and this would easily fit my camera my phone my hand sanitizer my mask all that kind of stuff in really really easily and i wouldn't have a problem i believe it was under 20 pounds and such a cute style um asos and asos have really nailed it this year with bags they've got some really beautiful styles that are really affordable and to be honest i think a cream bag is just such an essential to a wardrobe for spring and summer because it just goes with everything and sometimes if you've got quite a dark outfit it's nice to have like a cream bag or something just to give it a little bit of a lighten up so that one is definitely a welcome addition then we have this bodysuit which is the season's must-have color i swear it's everywhere at the moment if you're a neutral lover and you don't go into like pastels and stuff this is the color that you need to be adding to your wardrobe which is a gorgeous like dark chocolatey brown um personally i don't really go into like color that much i'll wear like neutral earthy tones but i don't really venture into like pastels or anything so this is quite colorful for me and i just really like it kind of adds a little bit of something to a wardrobe that is fairly otherwise black and white I am making an exception today and wearing this green Zara bodysuit, but that is just because I realised all I wear is black and white. But anyway, this bodysuit is gorgeous. It is, I got a size 8, which is true to size for me, and it fits really nicely. It's got this gorgeous, like, piping detail under the bust here with the little seams, so it kind of, like, flatters your boobs. I personally have tried this on with a bra underneath, and it looks great, but it also looks really good without a bra because it just, it kind of, like looks like they're lifted but they're not i don't know how to explain it but it's really lovely and the fabric is really nice and thick on this one so it's kind of that perfect like will keep you cool in spring and summer but it's also thick enough to like be a bit warmer on chilly days and it's just really really cute i don't know if it comes in any other colors but this one i particularly enjoyed then we've got this little denim skirt because my black slit skirt goes everywhere with me i love it so much and cannot wait to wear it out and about when we finally get into the kind of actual spring and summer when we're allowed out of our house and this one is just a really cute little denim number so cream as you can see with the two little slits at the bottom and then it's just got a zip up the back i do have to say it does come up a little bit big so i bought an eight which is true to size and it's a little bit big around the waist i feel like i could have sized down and it probably fit a bit nicer but obviously personal preference whether you want it to be really tight or not i just think it might have looked a bit nicer if it was tighter but it's really really cute and asos design is really good for denim pieces especially kind of skirts and jackets and stuff so if you're looking for denim shirts or anything like that i definitely recommend checking them out then we've got this little smock jumpsuit which it's kind of like the ease into dungarees for me because I want to be a dungarees person so bad, but I just haven't found any that suit me yet. And this style fits really nicely and I just bloom and love it. So this is actually sized up by one and I maybe shouldn't have done that. I should have just got true to size because it is a bit big, but it's a really gorgeous like smock style jumpsuit with the kind of supposedly collot length. I'm five foot four and it comes up quite long on me. And then it's just got the little ties on the shoulders here. So you can kind of loosen it if you wanted to, but it's really cute, really girly. I wore it with a black bodysuit underneath the other day and it looked really cute, but obviously you could wear a t-shirt underneath or whatever, or you could just wear it without anything, but it's so cute and it looks really good with sandals or boots so highly recommend if you are like me and you want to love and wear kind of dungaree style vibes but yeah <laughs> i just really like it it's like the one thing that was kind of a wild card for me i didn't know if i'd like it and if i'd wear it but now i've got it i love it and i also think when we are eventually allowed to travel again it's the perfect like plain outfit because you can put a jumper or something underneath and then you're just like nice and snuggly and warm and you don't have to worry about being comfortable or uncomfortable then last from asos we have this which is my favorite thing from asos ever i think it's so lovely if you haven't had asos outerwear before i highly recommend checking them out because their outerwear is always the best this is what i got 
On the website it does come up as saying it's grey. It's absolutely khaki green. It is not grey at all. There's no, like, it, it literally is the colour of this and this is khaki green. So it's not grey. But um, it literally is the colour of my bodysuit which is khaki. But it's a really nice heavy trench coat which is kind of like a linen-y, like canvasy material. Really beautiful, looks amazing on, perfect length. I honestly, I think this is my new spring staple coat. I just love it. I love that it's belted so I can tie it up. I love that it goes with everything in my wardrobe. And I like that it's not black or white because it's that perfect kind of medium earthy tone that kind of ties in my whole wardrobe, but allows me to wear that little slice of color that I wouldn't normally pick up. Can't remember for the life of me the price of it, but size wise I got an eight and it does come up perfectly fine. So I recommend getting true to size on that one. Then moving on, we've got Pretty Lavish, which is a brand that I'm kind of new to experiencing. Like I've never really shopped there until recently and they do have some really, really great pieces which are definitely worth having a little look at and investing your money into, especially if you are someone who likes a kind of more timeless capsule style wardrobe and you like things that will be able to go with pretty much everything and also be able to kind of last in your wardrobe season upon season. So first up, I have something which I did get in two colors no shame if i like something i do tend to buy it in multiple colors and it's just this little satin shirt which is kind of like ever so slightly striped but i could not resist getting two there's something about that like pajama style silky shirt that just screams spring and summer to me and it just honestly is the best way to slightly smarten up an outfit like if i was going to a restaurant for dinner i would just chuck one of these on with some sandals or some mules and good to go looks a bit more stylish also looks great with sandals or whatever it is you choose to wear it with there is actually a reel on my instagram which i'll leave linked down below where i styled up both of these in an all white and an all black look so yeah really like them the white isn't too thin either so like i wore a lace bra underneath and you can't see it which i think is quite testing sometimes if you wear a white lace bra you can really see it but it's really beautiful so they've got buttons down the front and then i don't know if you'll be able to see better on the black or the white but they've got these gorgeous like button detailings down the cuff and it's quite a deep cuff which is really lovely and they are quite long as well so really versatile really easy to style really easy to wear i got both of these in a small medium which comes up perfect on me i think it's the perfect amount of like slightly oversized and slouchy they did also have medium to large which i'm not sure what exactly the sizing is on them then we have a little jumpsuit it was again uh, just something i can wear really easy comfy lounge around the house but also wear out if i need to so I work from home year round. There's been no kind of change in the last year for that for me. And I like to know that when I'm working from home, I can put on something that's kind of a little bit like smarter, but still feels really comfy. And this was the kind of vibe that I went for. So this is a ribbed jumpsuit with a little short sleeves, little tie waistband, and it just looked so cozy and comfy on the model that I couldn't resist getting it. It comes in a few different colors. And honestly, I haven't tried it on yet, but I think it's gonna be the comfiest thing I've ever put on my body because it just looks so cozy. And like I said, perfect for kind of lounging around the house, but also again, great for adventures if you're going on a plane or something because you can just chuck this on and it'll be cozy. Um, also one of those things which I think would be really nice to wear with like a leather jacket and some trainers if you're going for a walk. Like I would personally wear this with Converse and a leather jacket tomorrow for a walk if it's sunny. Um, Cause I think it's really cute. And again, just a really easy kind of slouchy style. That one I got in a small medium again as well. And then again, the last thing I did get in a small medium, I'm not sure why pretty lavish sizing is always small, medium, medium, large. I, I don't know why that is. Um, but I got this dress, which was also, I, I mean, I picked these things when it was still really cold and now it's kind of sunny and I'm actually boiling. But this was again, something I could wear inside or outside. And it's just a nice little like wrap tie side dress. So it is a midi dress, but it comes up quite long on me. And it's just got a gorgeous crossover at the front with the kind of slightly balloon sleeved sleeves. Um, I haven't tried this on yet, so I don't know how it fits, but on the model on the website, it looked stunning. And again, really easy to wear around the house, really nice for working from home, but also something I could wear out and about if I wanted to. I have to admit, it's probably more something for kind of colder days in spring with maybe chunky boots or something like that. Um, but also obviously I can wear it into autumn, winter as well when that time comes again, but it's just really cute. It's also quite nice and like lightweight so it's not going to be too heavy because sometimes when you get knitted dresses they're just so heavy and this one's quite nice and light and i also think it'll be very silhouette hugging in a nice way because it's not tight but it'll be nice and like cinching you in at the waist and like just flowing and like pop a leg out kind of vibe <laughs> but i really hope you enjoyed this video guys don't forget to give it a like and a thumbs up 
Don't forget to give it a like and a comment and all that jazz. Let me know if there is anything you would like to see a styling video on, whether it's a trench coat, the knitted dress, the smock dress, whatever it might be. Let me know if you'd like any styling videos because I put those up every Tuesday and yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys. Bye.